Hey guys, what's up? Anyways, there was a guy that was asking like, how does Mo does uh, Cataclysm Mist the Pandaria have like lights on the ground in, in Dust Woods? And the misconception that a lot of people think is that it's done by the M2 files, like the lamps there, but it's not. And to prove that in this little piece, I took out the loading of M2s and WMOs so that when I do go back in game, that those are gone. And they, you can see that that the, the, the light vertex is still showing. And it's something that's new within Cataclysm and it was improved in Mr. Pandaria and so on and so forth. All right, so uh, yeah, I, I made him disappear just to show that mis that misconception is false. So whoever's spreading that around is an idiot, all right? So anyway, I took it a step further and uh, ran into a couple errors because I totally forgot to resize some uh, chunks that I took, file, uh, took data uh, out of. But um, basically what I'm doing right now is removing the light vertex out of the, uh, the map chunks. And so that when I go back in game, you can see that the doodads aren't the things that are causing it, just to prove that little point. So here the doodads are back on, the BMOs and so on and so forth, but the light fields are gone. All right. And uh, yeah, so that was pretty much the idea of that. And that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this little tidbit. Uh, it's just a little tip video. It's not like anything crazy or nothing like that, but I figured I'd make a narration video out of this because uh, yeah, I thought it might help people out and I don't do very many uh, narrated videos and such. So yeah, alrighty, bye-bye.